Hello children, welcome to today's lesson. I am still Boniface Samson and I will be taking you on mathematics. Topic, number line, using number line to add and subtract. That is addition and subtraction using number line. Let's write it. Addition, addition and subtraction using number line number line on our previous topics we talked about addition and subtraction the first topic the previous one was addition and the next one was subtraction these topics we are taught on our previous topics. Now, what is addition? Addition is joining two or more numbers together. Addition is joining two or more numbers together. What is subtraction? Subtraction is taking away small number from the big one. Subtraction is taking away small number from big number. Now, how can we do this using number line? Number line is just like a long line. A long line like this. A mighty line like this. And it will start from zero. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Let's stop at ten. Although we can even reach twenty if we want to. This is what is called number line. Assuming we are giving something like five plus four. 5 plus 4. Remember, if you see plus sign, it means join them together. While if you see minus sign, it means remove. Now, this is join them together. If you want to use this method to join them together, first thing, look at the first number, which is 5. Now, draw a big line like this and look for 5. Stop there. This is 5. If you are counting it, don't start from 0. Count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is where your 5 should be. 5. Now, what are we adding to it? 5 plus 4. 5 plus 4. How are we going to use this method and add 4 to it? When you stop at 5, you start counting this side. Remember, in addition, backward, never. Forward, ever. We'll start from five and move forward and count four numbers. One, two, three, four. I repeat, from five, you jump it, move. One, two, three, four. That means if we add four to it, we'll have this number called nine. You extend your line to reach that place, you stop. That is to say, 5 plus 4 is equals 9. 5 plus 4 is equal to 9. Let's check whether we are correct. If you do 5 plus 4 equal to, let's count it. Uh, using stone. One, two, three, four, five. Plus, what is this? Four. Count it. One, two, three, four. This is this sign means join them together. Let's join them together and know the answer. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. 
Nine. Check whether we are correct. What is this? Nine. What is this? Nine. Where did our arrow stop? Nine. This is called addition using number line. Addition using number line. Now let's move to subtraction using number line. Subtraction using number line. Assuming we have 7 minus 4. In subtraction, I will show you how to do it. Let's draw a big line. We have 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Let's stop here. Now we have the first number is 7. Remember this sign is minus, which means remove. Which means remove. First thing, get your number. This is 7. We target where 7 is and drop our arrow there like this. This is where 7 is. Now, minus means remove. When you are removing, you will be going backwards. It's only minus that you can go backward. In addition, forward, ever. Backward, never. In subtraction, backward is allowed. Now, if you want to subtract 4 from 7, that's 7 minus 4. 7, you remove 4 from 8. We'll start from here and count 4 backward. And count 4 backward. If you are adding, you count forward. If you are minusing, you count backward. Now from 7, let's count backward. 1, 2, 3, 4. Because we are removing 4. From 7, you count backward. 1, 2, 3, 4. Where did our 4 stop? In this number. Three. We trace it back and go to this place and put it. That means our answer is three. Our answer is three. Are we correct? Now this is seven. Let's count out seven stones and remove four. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7. You remove 4 from 8. Let's remove. 1, 2, 3, 4. How many is left? Let's count. 1, 2, 3. What is our answer? 3. That means we are correct. And this is the end of our lesson today. Next time we'll meet again. Okay? I remain your teacher, Bonifrey Samson. Bye-bye.